Hello and welcome to the final episode of the YouTube Tips and Tricks Help Series, episode number 8, Channel Tips. So just to cap it all off, thank you guys for all your continued support of the series and hopefully it helps some of you guys out. If you haven't checked out videos 1 through 7, you can check out video 7 down the link below in the description. And you can also check out the playlist to get every video of this series. So without further ado, let's finish up this series. And we have four parts to this one. Number one, know your RSS feed. You can get this by doing your username forward slash video dot RSS. You could upload in 3D. YouTube is always experimenting with new features. Just add this, and this will be down below. YT3D colon enable equals true. In your video tags, to make your video as 3D it will automatically change it to the 3D version. You need special glasses to watch these 3D videos in 3D. In 3D videos, some of the features currently not available are, are like captions and subtitles. Feather. If you are using very slow internet connection, you can enable the Feather Beta facility on YouTube. If you enable this facility, you can watch video page without unnecessary options. Enable Feather Beta here, which you could look it up on Google, and it will avoid loading of the related videos and comments, etc. And finally, use annotations. You can use YouTube annotations efficiently with your creative idea. You can use don't click here text as an annotation. When people watch your videos, they often want to click it as it is human nature. You can link the you can link the do don't click here annotation to your channel or any of your particular videos. When more people click the annotation, the video automatically gets selected as related videos. But remember, don't use your think out of the box ideas for spamming purposes. User may dislike or flag your video. So that is the end of the YouTube tips and tricks help series, guys. Hopefully this helped. You can check out the entire series in the playlist. And hopefully you guys enjoyed. So remember to leave a like for this awesome last episode. If you have any questions, feel free to comment or email me. And remember, all the links are in the descriptions. And you can go Google whatever you don't know. So that is it for this series, guys. Thanks so much for your support. And I will see you guys later.